Hi guys, Ralph Roberts, W5VE here. And I got something I wanted to uh, try out. Channel mode. This is a uh, little Bifang walkie talkie. The uh, infamous uh, UV5R. And you notice it doesn't have an antenna. We're going to cure that in just a moment, but let me get get it on a repeater frequency One, two, three, four. okay we're going to hook it up on the Mount Mitchell repeater now we need an antenna back in the day when I was in Vietnam that's 50 years ago we had this uh, Portable radio walkie-talkie supposedly called a ANPRC6 used miniature tubes and with the batteries it weighed uh, I don't know 10 15 pounds it was heavy but you could hold it up and talk only it, it didn't have hardly any range and practically no battery life to speak of but it had a tape antenna or you could just unfold it and it would uh, pop up sort of like this. This is 42 inches, I think. So I should step back a little bit. It's called an, an AB, ABBEE, and I'll put a link to it below. And it's set up to, to just. I don't want frequency mode. Channel mode. I want channel mode. So it should just screw into the uh, Bifang UV5R. This is, of course, 2 meters and 440, this version of it. And there we go. We've got a 42 inch antenna on this little 5 watt walkie talkie. Let's see. Uh, See if I can hit the Mount Mitchell repeater. That's about 20 miles from here. Oh, yeah. Turn up the volume a little bit. Uh, QRZ, QRZ. Oops. QRZ, QRZ. Whiskey 5, Victor Echo. W5VE for radio check. W-A-4-K-X-X, you found it here. W-A-4-K-X-X, W-5-V-E. Thank you, sir. Name's Ralph, R-L-P-H. We're in Alexander, just outside of Asheville. And what I'm doing here is a YouTube video showing off the new Abbey antenna I got for my UV-5R Bifang. It's a 42-inch antenna with a... Uh, uh, it's like a tape antenna. If you were ever in the Army, you remember the ANPRC-6. Well, it has a tape antenna like that. It's 42, 42 inches high. And I'm rather shocked. I'm just standing here in the yard and talking to um, Mount Mitchell. Yeah, Roger. I just left Asheville a little while ago. I'm, in, uh, I'm about 80 miles from Bristol, Tennessee right now. I'm about 25, 30 miles from Knoxville. Oh, I'm copying you fine. A little bit of noise, but nothing very bad at all. Yeah, this this is amazing. I just, uh, you know, Amazon they deliver on Sundays now, and I just unboxed this and hooked it up, and it seems to be working real well. It's uh, quite impressive looking. Have this big of antenna on on this small radio. Well, you picked a good day for it. The uh, leaves are starting to change color. If, if you said you went through ice, I believe, and uh, the, it's pretty. It's warm. It's uh, a nice day to be out playing with your new antenna. I just ran out of battery. But anyway, it worked.
works. I'll take this thing and put it on the charger. Thank you. Okay, my battery is about gone. I should have charged this before I started this test. Three. It is gone. But I'm pleased it works. So, let's take it off. We're going to turn off the radio. Unscrew the antenna. There we go. And it breaks right down. A little uh, a little loop to put it in and it's ready to go back in the to go kit or whatever I use it for. And that's been it. A test of the Abbey A B B R E E Abrey, I guess. It costs about twenty dollars. It's available on Amazon. And I will put the link down there. It's female SMA. I suppose you can get another configurations also but this one works on the uh, uh, buy things there you go it's Ralph W5VE in Alexander North Carolina thank you very much